Hello everybody, it's Mike here at Game From Scratch, and for a day where I intended to stick my head in the sand, there's been a lot of news that I've been reporting. And this is the last one, I promise, but today there was another Humble Bundle released that is of some interest to game developers, specifically C-sharp based language game developers, because that's what this bundle is all about. Microsoft and .NET, with a heavy focus on C-sharp. Now this is relevant to game developers because uh, C-sharp is quickly taking over the world, it seems. It is the number one programming language for uh, the Unity game engine, and on top of that is also used in other game engines such as CryEngine, uh, Godot, um, Zenko, and so on. It is a very popular language for game developers. So if you've been looking at getting into C Sharp, is this bundle right for you? And the simple answer to that question is, do you have any books about C Sharp? Do you want a book about C Sharp? If you answered yes, this bundle is for you, as you will see in a second. Now, if you've got no interest in C Sharp or .NET at all, there's probably not going to be anything in here for you. But without further ado, let us take a look. Now, first, we should probably talk about what Humble Bundle is all about, just in case you don't know. And basically, it is a collection of things, generally books, uh, games, software, comics, uh, other kinds of media bundled together around a common theme with proceeds going to different areas. So you can decide when you buy it, if your proceeds go to charity, to Humble, uh, to the original publisher, or of course to this channel if you help us out. Which, by the way, thank you. I appreciate it if you do. And let's take a look at what is in this bundle. Now, as with all Humble bundles, I have purchased it to give you an idea of what the file formats of each book are. Now, obviously, this is a book collection. It is a book collection from A-Press entirely. So if you do not like A-Press books, there is not a lot here for you. But the books are all... Um, quite good in my opinion, A-Press books generally. Uh, now this particular bundle, just like all bundles, is done on tiers. So if you pay a dollar, you get everything at the dollar tier. If you pay eight dollars, you get everything at the eight dollar and all the tiers below it. In this case, there are three tiers, one dollar, eight dollars, and fifteen dollars. At the one dollar tier, if you're looking for a C-sharp book, this is good. Uh, we've got the C-sharp 7 quick reference, quick syntax reference, the Visual Studio Code distilled. If you've never used Visual Studio Code, uh, the open source IDE or text editor, I highly recommend you do so. Uh, the Microsoft Computer Vision APIs distilled. Uh, the Microsoft, Z I'm sorry, the beginning Xamarin development for Mac. Xamarin was the open source port of uh, the C-sharp language uh, and the .NET runtime. It has since been acquired by Microsoft. Um, and then we've got modern API design with ASP.NET Core 2. So that's the $1 tier. If you move on up to the $8 tier, you also get Cosmo DB for um, MongoDB developers, uh, modern data access with Entity Framework Core, uh, Azure and Xamarin Forms, beginning Entity Framework Core 2.0, uh, developing bots with Microsoft Bots Framework, um, Essential Docker for ASP.NET Core MVC or Model View Controller, and then probably the prize of the books, Pro C Sharp 7. So if you're looking at just getting into C Sharp and you don't already have a good collection of books, this one and the quick reference are probably all you really need to get started. And then you've got one here to get you started from an IDE perspective or a text editor perspective. So that would kind of have you covered. So if you jump up to the $15 tier, what do we get? We get hardening Azure applications, Azure being Microsoft's cloud-based uh, hosting, kind of the equivalent of EC2. Um, we've got uh, beginning XML with C-sharp 7, modern algorithms for image processing, Xamarin form solutions, uh, deep learning with Azure, uh, IoT or Internet of Things, AI and blockchain for .NET so we can get all of our buzzwords together in one book. Uh, practical bot development. And again, this is using the Microsoft Bot Framework. And then we've got Microsoft, introducing Microsoft Teams, their uh, chat-based collaborative workplace system that's built into Office 365. So we're definitely getting a little bit more enterprise-y with the top tier. And then proceeds can go to Dress for Success Charity. Now, if you've never, um, if you don't like that particular charity, they have a number of different options you can go towards as well. And that is, in a nutshell, this month's Humble Bundle. Now, as I said, I always buy the bundle so you have an idea of what you get. And in this month, it is pretty straightforward. So from a book perspective, you get every book in PDF and EPUB formats only. So unfortunately, no Mobi in this particular version. So every single book is available in these two formats. Now, if you've never seen it, this is what it looks like for you. You just come on in here and you can do a direct download right here uh, in the various different formats. So just click the one you want and it'll download or click this button right here and it will do a download for every single version you've got. You've also got BitTorrent options if you want to bring it down that way. Um, so there are a number of different ways you can download it. Plus, you can keep it as a library on Humble server. There's no need to do a one-time download. You can get to this stuff as much as possible. So the question is ultimately... 
what is the value here? Is it worth it? Well, if you look at it, uh, you're not going to get a single one of these books for less than $15 US unless you find it really heavily on sale. But my recommendation is every single time one of these Humble Bundles comes up, look at the book you're most interested in and then look it up on Amazon. You want to check a couple things. You want to make sure that you're getting a reasonably current or the most current version, and then you want to compare the pricing. So for example, the Pro C Sharp 7 book is available um, on Amazon, the what version we've got here, we'll check it out, but this was at the $8 tier. So now let's head on over to Amazon, as soon as I find it. Where do we go? All right, here we go. So here we are in the Amazon store, and you will see that that book is currently uh, version 8, so the 8th edition. It is available on Kindle starting at $40. So right there, you have uh, two and a half to, no, actually it was eight. Uh, so you got a four or five times uh, savings on this if you buy just the middle tier versus buying this book individually. Now, I'm not saying you can't get this book on sale or cheaper at some times, but just do check to see what the current version is. So you see we're dealing with 8th edition and it's 40 bucks as opposed to 8. So this is a, uh, on its own a deal. Now the book itself, here it is. I've downloaded the PDF version and you will see it is Pro C Sharp 7. 8th edition. So you are dealing apples to apples. This is the most current version. And as you can see, Humble Bundles, when they contain something that you want, definitely are a good deal, especially if you're looking at the most recent version. Now that's the one gotcha you'll get with this stuff. Sometimes the Humble Bundle is the previous version and it's a bit of a hook to try and get you to buy the newest version. And don't get me wrong, even the 7th the edition of this book is probably still valuable. Um, but that is one of the areas where that sometimes isn't as good of a deal as it initially appears. In this case, the books I checked were the most current version, which does make this more and more useful. All right, so that's it. That is the uh, humble Microsoft.net bundle. If you are uh, looking at getting into Unity development or Zenko or Godot using C Sharp or CryEngine or the various other different game engines that use C Sharp as a language, especially now that Unity has come into the modern world as implementing and supporting C Sharp 7 and the newest versions and such, I, I do recommend you have a good foundation in the language. And these books would be a good way of giving that to you. So if you're looking at getting into C Sharp or um, you're looking to improve your skills a bit. This could be a really good bundle for you. If you don't, if you're not interested in C Sharp at all, um, yeah, there's probably nothing here for you. But you probably knew that coming in. All right. Hopefully, some of you guys, some of you guys found that useful. If you have any more specific questions about anything here, obviously I purchased it. I can look it up for you. Um, as always, I can't read these books in instant time, so I can't tell you, you know, just how good they are. But generally, A Press is pretty solid. But if you have any comments down below, let me know, and I will do my best to answer them. All right. Thanks a lot. Talk to you all later. Goodbye.